So we're switching things up. I've been out in Sabine Lake pretty much all day. Decided to come back to Cal Bayou and try to catch bass. I jumped off a two pounder, caught a ladyfish, and just caught a really nice redfish. All within like five minutes. So hopefully that's just not a fluke and be a bunch more fish in here. What a redfish. Oh my gosh, I hope the camera got that. Got a ladyfish. These things are excellent shark bait. There's a ton of shad. Y'all can't see this, but. There are so many shad schools around here, it's ridiculous. That's a redfish. It's a good redfish. <laughs> it's a real good redfish. He is not happy. Water bait isn't ideal to hit the brakes. If it gets around the metal, I might have to. How about that for a topwater redfish? Put this fella back. Catch him again another day. What's happening is the tide's flowing out to sea and we're just catching everything coming down this grass line. There's a grass line that runs down both banks 
I don't think one's better than the other. I've caught fish on both sides of it. I'm throwing a silver torpedo. There's so much shad in here and that's the closest thing I can get to a shad. Top water wise. Big lady fish. Nope, big gar. Thank you. Fish. That's a large mouth. I mean a real nice redfish. Get in that grass. Come here. Oh, he's gonna give up easy. Oh, that even that works even better. About to catch another one. I've handled enough today. That makes for a good, easy release. I don't have to get my hands wet. Why well, come off? He took my hook.
That's going out hard. And another one. Wasn't even paying attention. They're sitting beside behind these pylons. Magic pylon. Every one of them have that bait in his throat. Had another hit. The current breaks all it is. That might be fun. Good one. Well, a second ago, he was about three pounder chasing some calves. 